Hey everyone, welcome to a pickup video. And this pickup video, I only have two things to show you today. Um, besides the uh, got some sweet potato chips, but I'm not. I'm not gonna show you food. I don't think showing groceries is kind of like. But I have a couple things from Walgreens drugstore. Got these mini ornaments. Here's a Jack Skellington Santa. Uh, Hallmark made these, and I don't know why. And the Zero um, from the movie Nightmare Before Christmas dog or whatever. Um, what's that? Um, media was horrible this week, okay? Good news, I'm getting a package tomorrow. Bad news, it's going to be in next week's video. So, I outlet media kind of... This is from... Very Hungry Caterpillar Eats Breakfast. We're going to media right away, and then... It's uh, basically Very Hungry Caterpillar, if you know the story. The caterpillar eats a bunch of shit, and it becomes fatter than a hog. And whoever had the Dolly Parton Imagination Library shit on it. In Jefferson County, so we want to thank Allison, Erica, your book is in my hands. This is Lizzie McGuire, My Secret Journal, based on the 2000s Disney shit. Peanuts Guide to Life, which is basically Wooden Wisdom and the Peanuts. From the 70, 83, I think, these TV comics from Casper the Friendly Ghost. Got Paranorman, the movie novels. It started as a book, but I think it's like a movie. Um, by that one studio that then uh, David, Mr. David donated this I want to let you guys know if you donate stuff to Goodwill it's a good idea, it's a good idea to scribble out your name so <laughs> Steelers guy just, I think this from yeah, August 2022 yeah Turn off the names, um, if you're donating stuff, yeah, that's what I do, right here, and the one movie I got, it's a Walmart pickup, because, outlet, there were zero movies this week, which kind of sucks, but let's face it, Spider-Man in Across the Spider-Verse, I know they're making a third one, but it's been delayed due to... The everlasting love of God, son of a gun, Hollywood strikes. I already rant and rave it, uh, my two cents, but I'm going to make this clear. It's just becoming to a point where make a deal or hire robots. One of the two things has to work out. Because I'm not going to sit here and watch, I know a lot of the, um, so I got, that. that's the only movie this week. Uh, let's see, I'm going to go to this. So, back to school, last year, if I were doing videos last year, I think I did, I had that Rugrats, um, I think either before I did the videos or some dumb thing. I had the Rugrats uh, binder bundle. Has to be appropriate, Super Mario. And um, going with notebook composition, binder, a uh, DP sealed. And if I need a notebook from this or binder or some dumb thing, I'll get it. Okay. We have to go for the plush here. Yeah, um, there's usually a couple women that resell shit. Look at this. I am not. 
joking. I am literally, usually I don't buy this amount of plush, but at the, by the pound outlet stores, charge very little, if any, say about 25 to 75 cents guesstimate. So we have a 30th anniversary happy meal, uh, Thai Beanie Baby, so adding that to the little collection. Bloom, this is why you don't believe in shit. The blue m m did have candy at one point, but people threw out the candy. I don't care. I'm not like that, uh, come with cartoons. It's kind of weird. Got Snoopy as the aviator of the Snoopy and Friends. I have, comment down below, this is from Hot, uh, some company in New York. I, it's online, so probably late 90s, early 2000s. I have another one of those, the Joe Cool one. I know Mary's going to be watching this video saying, why do you have Snoopy? Well, it's good enough. We have, and this is why, I hate glitter. This is a Disney Store exclusive Tigger with scarf and a hat. I'm checking the hat here. There's so much shit. Disney, a later Disney Store exclusive, not the... The one that cost 90 bucks, I told you, that Wolf, the Lost Boy from Peter Pan, I don't know how much this cost, but if a Disney store, um, because they're mostly gone, I, I think the only state, there are a couple states that still have them, but a lot of them closed, a lot of them want to go online, so... I'm not expecting Goodwill to do that because one, they need the jobs, and two, so we have a Rambo Mickey Mouse, a uh, Minnie Mouse, excuse me, uh, one of the mal mice from uh, Cinderella, but this one is by Mattel and has the sugar bean. So I think with Mattel, this is probably from the 90s when the whole Beanie Baby craze and you saw one just a moment ago. A lot of companies wanted to cash in on that crap. I think this is one of them. One of the mice was in the rough by Mattel. Sugar bean or whatever. I do not know. A sugar bean. Jeanette won the... Um, don't know who this is, the nerd one uh, from Jim. I know Theodore is with this chick, but I don't know. It's from Ty. I usually get anything Ty because, unless for the big shit, this is like the right size of plus. Is that right? So that's fun. The wink. Just hold on. I know this is usually part of the video. You're asking me, why am I paying on moving? Here's the box of crap. Went to regular Goodwill. Many of you have watched, if you watched that great collection purge video, I said I'm doing stuff to Goodwill. Unfortunately, the one store I went to did not have any movies, did not have any books. I think I only got. I only got the Paranorman, his hippy dippy costume glasses. I don't know if these are legit. So we got peace sign glasses and the rainbow tie dye. And I'll show you the, the other thing. It's pretty cool. Found this at the outlet, one of these Chick fil A cows. I have so many of those Star Wars cows. This is from a, uh, if you know where I am, you know, see your points, just a sort, this is a peanuts ruler that originally sold for three bucks, probably got it for like 50 cents, and I think it's lenticular. Is this lenticular? I don't, I don't think so, maybe it's the same lens. Um, got this, and let me explain, I... I do have some pillow pets. That's that, that you have 
Yeah, and this is, I've never seen this one. It's called a mini pillow pet, and it's a ladybug. Got mini Cogsworth from Beauty and the Beast, a mini Harry Potter. Um, Tommy Pickles at Okie Dokie Jones. Is this some Indiana Jones thing? This was the only find at three o'clock a uh, couple days yesterday. This Superman little person. One keychain of I don't know. Okay, okay, I don't know what that is. But going to the keychains. A minion with bendable arms. Patrick. Don't know if this was a Burger King. A lot of the SpongeBob toys were either Burger King sticking out. It's kind of like. This Detective Pikachu, I have the movie, haven't watched it yet, so don't spoil it for me. Susie Carmichael, apparently she had a pig, like a pig stand or something. Again, don't know. Open season, like... Like car, I think that was like... This 80s kind of thing, uh, trolls, give me a beat, so. Speaking of trolls, we got this little one, little flop mouth one from the anime series and the movies. We got the Red Hat Society key fob with a little thingy. Um, so I have one of the Walmarts I went to, and... One of the Walmarts I went to, I actually, um, you know the world's smallest toys blind bags? They wanted a dollar, and I got some blind bag toys, um, they were cleansing some shit out, uh, Walmarts usually do that, uh, got this alien from the Masked Singer, this was also a dollar, and I'm keeping in the bag, this magic mixies thing. Another one of these happy Halloween things. Uh, we have also another keychain, a little surprise keychain. So I got a couple Walmart ornaments. Um, as many of you may know, they have $5 ornaments at this one store. So I got Michael, uh, not Michael, Mario and Michelangelo are one of the turtles. I don't know if they uh, make a donut guy. Um, I have two of these, so I'm gonna show you one of each. We have Tweety as Harley Quinn. Um, Burger King kids uh, kids meal thing. They did release these. I don't know if it's here in the states or in the for. I know in the foreign countries they've been doing the shit out of this, but I don't know if the U.S. got in those. So, and also we have this. I think probably 80s or 90s TV uh, Porky Pig thing. Got an N. Well, I don't know what you call this. This is not a keychain. I think this is like the cheapest keychain you can do. We have some international frozen stickers from Penny. Buzz Lightyear. Little thing of Buzz Lightyear. Oh, off. The Invisible Man. Hotel Transylvania, probably. A minion. I'll show the menu. This is from Turning Red, um, the girl who magically turns into Chinese panda. So that's the girl, Mayor. So, understand. I am a mental health advocate, little button. Uh, oh, there is a Pokemon card. Um, here's the thing. I've been finding Pokemon cards in the bins, and I, if I, one that I don't have, I, 
I usually don't give a shit about Pokemon, but now I've been finding the cards. So. I'm more in one. I went to a uh, Oakstone, and the biggest issue we had, I think, we were at our um, first, our temper, our uh, uh, the building on Oakstone Drive, and people were fighting over these things. Um, there were fights. Literally, they said, "Oh, we're banning Pokemon," and me being not giving a rat's ass. I said, okay. Now they're popular 20-something years later. We have a couple adorables here. So we got, I don't know who that is. Looks like Milan. I think this is like Sophia the First. I don't know. And we got Tweedle D or Tweedledum. Uh, here's a view master rip, but ah, my vision cannot see this, so it's going to be like a display thing, or in a box somewhere. Um, Susie Carmichael, thinking this is from Burger King when they did the for a while, but I don't know across all the way Cranberries, I think, I think that's all. That's all. Oh, I got this. I don't know why Scholastic in the 2000s was saying, oh, here's a stuffed animal that comes with a book. They're called Teacher's Pets. Like a short little book, and let me show you. And I'm not joking here. See, it has a book in its mouth. Like a short, the shortest little book, I think. Kids were like, okay, we want to play with this silly stuffed animal. I think. That's it. And, oh, I have to, these are finds of the week because there's so many, I have a couple, I have, about nine things that are fine the week. So, um, Wendy from Bob the Builder. Apparently, she was in the outlet. You see a little bit of dirt on her hands. Some kid was probably playing in the mud or something. I. And this is Wendy from Bob the Builder. This is by Namco, 2006. So, and then, um, got one pop. Um, these are Funko Pops, so I got Sully from Mark's Monster. They're not Monsters, Inc., they're Monsters now. I don't know why Disney decided, oh, we're going to put it as Monsters. Is this from the original movie or University? I don't see who that kind of is. And then all of these are from Five Below. So right now, a lot of people ask me, why you go to Five Below Fruit? Because Gen Zers love it. I love it because Fungo Pops are $5.95. I got six of them. So we're going to look. This is from the Bob's Burgers movie. There's a Louise. Um, that's five below. So this is young Bob Belcher. I haven't seen the movie. I haven't seen it yet. Harry Potter, speaking of the little plus that I got. Oh, that's a, also in Bikini Burger Linda. Let's see that. Jose from Disney World, some parrot thing. And I have to put all my fun, the all of the Funko shelves, Funko uh, displays, totally minis from the Disney archives, and Snoop Dogg. Let me show you Snoop Dogg in a better. And then one last thing that's also a soup what we call super find the week. I don't know how to do this, so has to be cleaned. This is from nineteen
98. So this is an old pillowcase, but if you want $2.14, we got Scooby Doo pillowcase. So it has to be clean, and then I'm putting it on one of our one of my pillows if I have pillows. Okay, one. Yeah, that's a super fun the week. I will not be doing those super finds very often, but unless they're they're already so much fun, so I think there will be a super find the week. I don't know. I'm just seeing how crap goes. I really do see if uh, stuff thank you for watching the video please like comment subscribe it's always happy to and i'll see you next friday um before I, I will be updating you guys at the end of the month there's a big change coming zob with the channel um i used to do this and i'm gonna tell just tell you right now october 6th mark that will be the first friday i actually have to call called my father you see every i was doing these videos on sagittarius then dad's mystery illness and i had to do all of this on fridays it looks like october 6th will be and then you're going to be seeing the week's finds from september 30th through october 6th unless i add saturday's crap but i don't want to do that it's, it's literally not a maybe I'll, so October 6th, you're not going to be seeing a video. The 7th, you'll be seeing a video. Uh, thank you. Peace, love. Bye.